Our final icon changed the sport in ways that are almost immeasurable. Shane McConkey was born to ski. His father, Jim, was known as one of the best skiers of his time, recognized for his aggressive style and fearlessness in the air. The apple didn't fall far from the tree. In the 1990s, Shane quickly became one of the top freestyle skiers out there, winning multiple events before turning his focus to big mountain skiing. I guess I would like people to describe me as kind of a fun dork. <laughs> For the next decade, Shane was the man to watch, starring in multiple groundbreaking films where he pushed the boundaries of what was thought possible on skis. Base jumping is kind of a stepping stone from skydiving. And I'm a skier too, you know, so I kind of eventually had to throw the two together. <laughs> throw the two together. <laughs> but it wasn't just his jaw-dropping exploits that made him so influential. McConkie was the first to develop reverse camber skis, also known as rocker. He changed the sport uh, from the equipment standpoint with the ski he developed. Forever, skis were built with camera. They were curved like this, and, and Shane took them and flipped them over and curved them like this. It suddenly became all smeary and surfy and fun in the powder. And uh, look where rockers come since then. It's in every ski now, but really did change the sport. In March of 2009, McConkie tragically died in a ski-based jumping accident. But Shane and what he did for skiing will never be forgotten. Shane's legacy to me is just his smile. He had that just mischievous smile and a great sense of humor. Shane changed the way you just looked at yourself and looked at the world. He brought something out in you. His influence on equipment, his you know inspiration to people to get out and ski as much as they could and, and enjoy you know, every moment of their lives, that's a great legacy. Everybody loved Shane. It was just such a loss. It's sad to think about what else he might have accomplished. We really miss him. If people are going to describe me as an innovator, that'd be great, you know, but um, it's all about having fun for me. And uh, I'd like to be seen as somebody who helped the sport a little bit and, you know, showed some people new ways to have fun out there. That's, that's important for me.